Okay, this is my original clear cube. I've got it sitting on my vanity. And what I keep in this now are a lot of my fragrance samples I have in these drawers. And then here are my Joe Malone and my Bond Number no. 9 samples. And then I've got um, my Rose Amethyst lipstick and some more perfume. And this is just kind of like overflow of some different eyeliners and stuff that I don't want to get rid of. And then these are my a lot of my nail polishes. Let's see, it's another that boyfriend fragrance sample. Um, just stuff that I use all the time, like my top coats. Here's my, this is what I have on today, is the NARS Poker Face. And um, just some of my favorite nail polishes, my Chanel and different ones. And then over here, these are some eye brushes. And that teapot is my mom's wedding china and what we used all when I was growing up. So she gave that to me. I love teapots. And I know that you probably cannot see that, but these are my, let's see, this is foundation brushes and then that's just extra powder brushes and everything. Let's see. And so that is the original clear cube is the wide clear cube with my things in it and then over here I have just um, my brushes face brushes and then these are my eye brushes and then I have overflow in my bedroom but these are the ones I use on a daily basis okay with the wide clear cube you have more space up here on the top which I like because I keep you know my brush cleanser my fix plus contact solution, my Bioderma, um, this, I washed all my brushes last night, and this is my Chanel little touch-up brush, and it's still, it's pretty much dry. I keep that up here. Um, my Q-tips, um, that's the stuff for, that I've been using on my eyelids. Um, the little serum, SkinCeuticals. This is just for my cotton squares. This just has my Rafisa. Um, this is the Elastilash from Abaji. And then this is just a few short brushes that I keep up here. So, here we go. And then on the first drawer, I keep my lip products. And let's see, there's lip pencils. Lise Wadier, Quo. These are lip glosses, ones that I use a lot. Um, Chanel glossomers and I've gotten where I've just just about started keeping all of them that I get from now on in the um, boxes because it has the name on it and I like to know I like to know the name when I'm using those and then here's all the Le Maitier glosses and lipsticks and um, some other my lip kaleidoscope and then this drawer has some shadows and my Le Maitier shadows. This is the Chanel cake liner and the Makeup Forever cake liner and the Magnifix, uh, my sharpeners, um, the paint pots that I use the most, more shadows, and then these are my eye bases and my concealers that I use. Okay, down here are some eyeshadow palettes. Um, a Dior, Stila, the Naked Palette, Chantecaille, Mirabella, um, some of my Sue Deverett pencils, the Le Maitier Kaleidoscopes, Kiko Palette, just, you know, different things, and here's an eyeliner. But you can see in the wide cube, your drawers are not as deep, but you have more space, so that kind of helps because then you can see everything a little bit better. And then this drawer is my powders, um, bronzers, and like my Laura Mercier and my True Mineral Powders. I've gotten where I like to mix those. Um, pressed powder, bronzer, and um, blush. Moon Glow, the Satellite Bronzer. These are just some foundation samples. The Mirabella Bronzer, Sue Devitt, and then there's a blush, the Solomon Islands. And then the Lise Wache Havana. Laura Geller, 
just all my powders and stuff right there. And then the bottom drawer is blushes. So NARS blushes, some Bobbi Browns, MAC, cream blushes, um, Sue Devitt. Let's see. Where is that? This one is one of my favorites. It's the um, Poppy blush by Le Maitier. It's for lips and cheek. It's one of my favorites. So, that is the wide cube. Now, I do have more makeup in those drawers, but I'm not really doing a makeup collection video. I just wanted to show you what this looks like with my makeup in it um, and my setup. And then I usually have my little Mia back there. Just, I just stick it back there after I use it for it to dry, and I only charge it every once in a while. And then the, this is the hurricane glass that I keep my brushes, and then that's the headband that I use when I'm, you know, putting on my makeup and washing my face and everything. So here it is. If I had to say, if I had to pick between the original and this one, um, I'd say just like 55% this one. The only, the negative with this one is it takes up more counter space. Like, used to I could have plugged my hair dryer in and put it right here and now I can't do that anymore. So I do, I forfeit a little bit more counter space, but then I have more space in the drawers. So, and I do like that this comes with these grids already in it. I really like those dividers. But, I've just, this has just been, both of my cubes have just been some of my best purchases ever. I do not regret it a bit. So I hope this was helpful, and um, just leave your questions down below, and I will also put the link of the clear cube down below. Thanks. Bye-bye.